takes a lot of leading. This is an amateur bout, fought over 33 million dollars, and a catch with a big Takuro Ikuzu. It is sponsored by MMEBooks.com and Photography. Your first fighter stepping into the cage and fighting out of the red corner. Okay, so here comes the first fight, it's uh, Natalia Brown, he's from Wolfpack MMA. It's an amateur bout at 80 kilos. And Natalia's opponent again is uh, Ben Unique Bins, and he's from Total Combat MMA. So Nathaniel makes his uh, he makes his way into the uh, into the cage and just waiting for the entrance now of his uh, opponent tonight. Same thing again, looks like he's got the home support. now we're going to get the final words off the uh, the man in charge and then back into the action so again you got Nathan Brown in the uh, in the red corner and you've got Ben a unique bins in the blue corner well here we go again safe yep eight kilo amateur about yeah I think uh, when I was speaking to Ben he was saying that he'd love to win by way of Omar Plata rubber guard so we'll wait and see yeah, well, they're definitely both straight into the action. To be quite honest, they're both definitely into the action. There's obviously, you can see there, you know, Nathan's looking, he's got that double under hook, he's trying to get that double under hook to look for that takedown. There they are, they're in again. But uh, he's doing a really good job, he's been keeping him up against that cage. Yeah, Nathaniel's more from a striking background. Uh, he said he wanted to go amateur just to test his groundwork and see how he does. Yeah, well, I'd definitely give that takedown to Ben, to be quite honest. Um, you know, you're going to have to see 
what kind of technique he's got. He's doing a good job at scrambling, to be quite honest, uh, from what I can see. But uh, Ben, obviously, he's, uh, he's, got, he's in that half guard at the moment, but he's looking like he's trying to work to a better position from where he is. Yeah, he's keeping active. He's trying to keep his posture nice and tight on him, keep his shoulder on tight with the hope that he can release that leg. But Nathaniel's been very clever and pulled him back into guard. Yeah, without a doubt. You can kind of see anyway, say, what kind of ground game some of them have got because, in all honesty, yeah, you are trying to score and win the round, but you know that you can do a lot more from side control than you can from inside somebody's guard or whatever. So if they're prepared to work and pass that guard, you know they've got, yeah, I've got some skill factor when it comes to being on the ground. Oh, Nathaniel really has gone for the triangle. He's really working the ground game. He's held on to the leg as well, so he's going to singe it in nice and tight. Oh, yes. So yeah, we'll wait and yeah, see what happens. Yeah. He has to be careful. Position. He has to be really careful here with his triangle and his arm. But he's got oh, to tap. He's got oh, brilliant. Absolutely Good awesome. Technique. Good technique. Really quick finish there, to be quite honest. I mean, um, what he's done is there, he just left his arm in a little bit too long to be quite honest and you know, it can happen to anybody, he just extended off that, it looked like the triangle was going to come on, he did try a couple of times to really pick Nathan up and basically you know, dump him on the ground hoping that the actual triangle would break open but unfortunately you know for Ben it was just in tight enough for him to keep hold of the glove, extend up and obviously put the arm bar on and get the tap. I mean, it was good, it was fiery. It was, it was really good and it was really fiery. Yeah, it was a good bout that. It's just a case of obviously, you know, he just found himself locked inside that triangle and unfortunately just just said uh, just a bit too long.